What's up, Henry? Wouldn't you like to take a stroll somewhere? What, now? I can't at the moment, but stop by later and we'll go. Listen to me. Don't go there. What the hell is going on? Why are you standing around yelling in the middle of the road? For Christ's sake, lad. Don't you hold your life, dear. There's a plague in Merhoyed. Go while you still can. Sir Radzig Kobbola sent me. I can help you. You've a good heart, boy, but take my advice. Nothing good awaits you here. Good luck to you. Pater Noster, qui es in celis, sanctificetur nomen tuum, veniat regnum tuum, Fiat voluntas tua, sicut in celo et in terra, panem nostrum super substantialem da nobis hodi. Yeah. Are you Melikar? Oh, aye, that's me. I need to speak with the prisoner. And why is that? Who might you be? Henry, envoy of Saradzik Kobola. I'm sorry. I have other things on my mind right now. In case you hadn't noticed, we have pestilence raging here. No news? Hmm. Well... Since you serve Sir Adzig, you might be- Tell me what to do. There's a stable hand living with us here. Yes, I know him. And he knows some girl who helps out in the monastery infirmary. Your hanker, I think her name is. She might know someone to turn to. If she's actually there.
Very well. Thank you. If I have to go to the monastery, it's hard to. Others still. Very well. I'll make the rounds. I've daubed lime on the afflicted houses, but don't stay too long in those homes. <laughs> that I can promise. May the Lord watch over you. Have you come for my wife? You're out of luck. I'm old Straw, don't you know? Straw! You've taken my son. But you shan't take my wife. You bastard. I've come to help your wife. To help her over to the other side? Isn't that God's own truth? I don't have time to explain everything to you. I need to... So you don't have the time? Come here, you fucker! You'll pay for that. Leave me be. Don't speak to me. Hmm. Fever. Just like Melchar's wife. Sweet mother of God. Hmm. Fever. Just like Melchar's wife.
Jesus Christ be praised. Lord, please end this. Please. What's happened here? Things are bad. Very bad. First we get attacked by them brigand plague. Indeed so. Something's up with the village. Even the I heard the Luckily, young Straw saw them still over by the cross and woke the whole village. Who attacked? I don't know. Some bandits. Ever since. Did you put up a. F we most certainly did. Once Melikar heard. Good on you. How did. We gave them. Who are Melikar? That's right, you're not from around here, are you? Melikar's the one. Or was, I should say. The band. <laughs> Thanks. What's happened? Things are bad. Very bad. Plague? You Indeed so. Uh, the agony. Thanks. I need to talk. Sorry, no one's allowed inside. But I'm Sir Radzig Cobbler's envoy, and I I don't care if you're the Pope's envoy. If you want to talk to the captive, oh, you- Farewell. Hey, hey, hey. Huh? Why are you? Jesus, lad, what are you doing here? Can't you see the play cross on the door? I'm here because of it. The monastery sent me to help. God bless you, boy. It's about time. I need to know exactly what you're suffering from. Oh, I see. Well, I have a dreadful fever. My wife, too. I recall almost nothing of yesterday. I was raving for most of it. Is there anything else? Apart from the fever? Well, forgive me for saying so. The shit just pours out of me. I can't keep anything in. You have my thanks. I'll try to... Wait a minute, will you? Oh, I have one favour to ask. So tell me. I need to write my will. I might manage that. Excellent. So get... Yes? I, Vincent, son of Vincent, grandson of Vincent of Mehoyed, do bequeath my estate and all my worldly goods to my wife, Wilma. If my wife were to pass away with me... Mm-hmm. I bequeath all to my cousin, Dobesh, at this time the cobbler in Janowitz. In no event shall my prodigal son, Elia, the layabout and good-for-nothing, inherit a single groschen, all customs and traditions aside. Um, should I write that too? Yes, and then write, the executor of my last will is to be my good friend, Father Fabian, presently the parish priest at the church of St. Martin in Sasso. Anything else? This will was written down by. What is your name? Henry, presently in fealty to Sir Radzig Kobola. Well, I never. That will add some weight. Here, take my ring so Fabian will know it to be truly from me. You can never be sure nowadays. Lord, please end this. Please, no more. Where can I find Father? Well, where do you think? It's in my... All right. Yes. Go. Brother, dearest brother, is that you? 
Yes. I found this nearly here. Um. Wait, you're, you're not my brother. You're one of those brutes. Brother, lock the door. Brother, don't you recognize me? It's me. I'm your brother. I was gone for a long time. I've come back home for Advent, remember? Yes. Uh, yes. I remember. Give me a drink of water, brother. Oh, I'm thirsty. Terribly thirsty. I felt good luck to you. What's happened here? Oh, things are bad. Very bad. First we get attacked by them brigands. Plague, you say? Indeed so. Something's up with the village. Where will I... F uh, if you stand at the main gate of the state... I'd like to talk to you. I see. Well... Tell me more... Worse than you can imagine. The whole stud. Livestock. Sheep. Chickens. All dead or dying. No doubt the people will be next. Melakar's old woman's taken to her bed and it doesn't look good. Stroll's wife and brother. More and more. I'm sorry to hear it. I'm looking for a Matthias? The brigands got him. Poor lad. Thanks. Who are you? Can't you see we have the plague cross on the door? Please accept my condolences. Thank you. My poor good husband. I took care of him as much as I could. I'm sorry to hear that. What do you need from me? They sent me to the monastery for help. But I need to know how the disease shows itself. Yes, I'll tell you everything. But first help me bury my husband. I'm too weak. And Melikar said that... Of course I'll help. Thank you. We have to bury him at the back of the house. I understand. Thank you. When you're ready, come back. It's done. Thank you. Now please take him there. Oh, Lord. Merciful God, grant his soul eternal rest. Will you please tell me about his illness? Certainly. My husband had the fever all... Anything else? He had great pains in his belly. He said it felt like he'd been stuffed with rocks. He was writhing all night... Thank you. What 
am I to do? <laughs> hey, you! Don't move a muscle! Hey. Surrender! You'll have to answer for your law breaking. Now you're done for. I'm warning you, give yourself up! Ah. Got you at last. Now you'll get... What? Don't play the innocent. I have witnesses who saw you in the act of murder. Personally, I'd rather string you up. Look, I'll tell you the truth, but you mustn't... My heart... Jail? Just the account. Broken weeks. ribs. And now he's going to. Your hunker? Uh, what is Henry? He? I'm glad to see you. Me too. I heard that you're doing well. Well, that depends. You're alive. So you're doing well. What's hap- oh my god. Philip and- they're all- Yes? Where do you think the wounded ended up? Actually, uh, I... Well, now you know. Me and Nicodemus have been trying to keep just the two of us. I don't know if you've heard about it, but Merhoyed was attacked. Oh god! How is Matthias? Wounded in the arm. He's being brave about it, but his injury looks bad. I need to see him. Before you go, there's something else. What? Some kind of disease has taken hold in Merhoy. I thought maybe someone here might know what to do. Merciful heavens. How awful. It's a good thing you've come here. If there's any hope, this is the place to find. He may know how to deal with it. Very well. Come back when you know more. Thank you, Johanka. Some kind of... Your hanker said that you might be able to... A disease, you say? Please, help me. I can't. I just can't. <coughs> yes, yes, it's very interesting. I can't say at this point. Tell me. Well, I expect so. Mehoyed? Isn't there a stud farm there? Yes, there's a stud farm. And they've all died off. That is most in... What are we to do about... Do you know the symptom? Yes, more or less. Excellent. I can't stay here. Yes, I can. Excellent. So follow... So... Evidently there's something amiss in the di... In the what? The digestive tract. Um, right. <sighs> the trouble lies between the mouth... Uh-huh. We can rule nothing out at this stage. You look in the breviarum to see... But I don't know... Fortunately for you, our brother librarian... Study the breviary carefully. I'll try the proven classics. May the Lord watch over you.
Who's there? Whatever can it be? Febris Igaza Ignota. Please help me. Whatever can it be? Febris Igaza Ignota. Yes, yes, that would make sense. Please. Lord, oh Lord, what time do you live in? Could it be? No, probably not. I can't stay here. I can't sleep again. Lord, oh Lord, what times we live in. Hmm. Yes, yes, that would be nice. uh. I think I have. Yes? And what do you make of it? <coughs> Can I take a look? What's got into you, boy? The grounds inside the monastery belong to the monks of the Order of Saint. Take care now. Lord, oh. Lord, what times we live in. Damn. Hmm. Hmm. Now what have we here? It was around here somewhere. Yes, yes, that would make sense. I can't stay here. Whatever can it be? Febris e causa ignota. A peculiar case. Lord, oh Lord, what times we live in. I think I have it. Yes? It's a gas poison. Really? That sounds rather unlikely. But if Master Yo, we shall have to prepare some medicine. I don't think I can help out with that. I didn't expect you could. 
You surprised me quite enough with your reading. But enough chatter. Time is of the essence. I'll get to work brewing the potion, and then head straight to Merhoyed. That works for me. But can't I help in some way? Best spend the time praying. We can always use God's help. Take care now. Father, Vincent of Merhoyed sent me to you. What's the matter, my son? I'm bringing Vincent's last will and testament. Almighty Father, be merciful. What happened? Master Vincent has been taken seriously ill. A disease has spread in Merhoyed. Yes, but Vincent is still alive? Yes. Let us hope the good Lord will leave him here with us a while longer. Thank you for bringing it to me. If Vincent passes on, I'll see you to it. Thank you. Good luck to you. So, here I am. How are things looking? Things are looking bad, lad. Very bad. Almost everyone died. We were too late. What about the captive? You mean that wretch they locked up in the barn? I don't know, lad. I doubt he survived, but best ask Melikar. Take care now. Melikar, where's... He died, Henry. That's what happened. And where's his body? We threw him down a pit behind the village there by the stone cross. Why? It's just that he might have had some clue to my investig... We drew lots to see who'd have to bury him, so you can be sure nobody went through his pockets. But if you plan to grope about his corpse and keep well away from Merhead after... Sure. Farewell. Hmm. A letter? That's odd. He doesn't look like a scribe.
Father, didn't I see you out? I wouldn't have expected that from a man of the... With a stick. I practiced with... Take care now. What do you want from me now? Let's have a word. Mm. All right, sir. I brought you something. Henry? Oh, it... My... I brought you something to... Thanks, Henry. I brought you something to... Henry. I brought you something to wear. Thanks, Henry. I brought you something to wear. Thanks, Henry. I brought you something to wear. I brought you something to wear. Thanks, Henry. Oh, it's a lovely... I brought you something to... Thanks. I brought you something to wear. I've got something that All right. I can't have you walking around in torn rags, can I? Henry! Wouldn't you like to... I'd love to. Henry... I don't want to complicate things, but how do you think it will be between the two of us? After all that's happened to us both, you're all I have left in my life. But you've got a lot of work for Sir Radzig and... And I'm afraid you'll have to leave me too. Have no fear. I'll never leave you. Wherever my duties might take me, 
we'll still be together. After all, you're all that's left to me, too. And even though everything might change... Henry, will you promise me something? Anything. Promise me you'll take care of yourself. Even if you were to go away for a long time and... meet other girls. If I were to lose you, too, I don't know what I'd do. Ah, oh, Teresa. Just promise me. I promise. Thank you. I know it's a hard thing to promise, but... You know? Well, we ought to be heading back. I still have work to do. Besides, you don't want to see me crying like a baby here. Definitely not. You'd start me off, too. <laughs> right then. Let's go. The time passes so quickly with you, Henry. Come and see me again sometime. Greetings. What business have you? I've returned from Mel. How does it look there? I found a letter that might explain something. What about the captive? Did you quite? He was infected too. I see. Did he survive? No. But even Daddy was of some use. It seems that bandit was a messenger. He was carrying a letter. That's interesting. And what's in the letter? Take a look for yourself, sir. Hmm. The names of the sender and recipient aren't written there, just the initials S and T. Seems to have some quarrel between them. This S person is threatening to finish with counterfeiting. Apparently, there's some German knight on the trail of the merchant Menhart. At the time the letter was written, the knight was in the tavern in Sassau asking about him. That sounds like a promising lead. You go to Sassau and find out what you can about this foreign knight. If he really is following Menhart, then he must know more than we do. Very well, sir. Don't go yet. There's something I'd like to talk to you about. Take care. You haven't disappointed me. Nothing against Bernard, Robard, or any of those others. But none of them could find out as much as you. At least not without beatings and torture. And that doesn't always work. You're a godsend, lad. Thank you, sir. Now go and find out who's behind everything, and then we'll deal with them. Yes, sir. Sir. What is it? Sometimes I ask myself what, what it all means. Why does God allow such things to happen? All this slaughter and revenge, over and over. It's a hard question. I'm no theologian. But long ago I came to the conclusion that the only thing that makes sense is that it's all a trial. Life is one long series of problems to solve. The more you solve, the better a man you become. I never thought about it that way. Well, just look at the pampered ones who have no concerns in life, like young Lord Capon, for instance. I shudder to think how he will rule when his time comes. Tribulations spawn in life over and over again, and we must stand our ground and face them. So, I go to Sasso and solve this one. Hmm? You can rely on me, sir. Good luck, son.